Hello every friends, welcome to Ibu's Gallery. I hope you guys are doing well. From the latest industry update to in-depth review of the hottest EV models, we are here to keep you charged with electrifying news and insights. So don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so that you never miss a shockingly good update. So let's wrap those engines and get started. A Tesla Cybertruck prototype was left covered on the side of a road a couple of days ago and someone stopped and took some pictures of the suspension components sending them to electric. After the blog published the image well-known vehicle teardown expert Sandy Munro made a video in which he analyzed the all-electric pickup truck's suspension setup. Embedded above, 30 minutes long presentation shows an independent front suspension with aluminum front lower control arm as well as air suspension strut. The reason for using aluminum at the front is that in case of the crash, aluminum cracks allowing the wheels to detach while steel bends and keeps the wheel in its place, which can lead to impact forces being translated into the cabin. An interesting thing is the presence of carbon fiber shield underneath the front part of the battery pack, supplemented by a steel undercarriage. The two teardown experts speaking in the video theorized that it could be a more cost-effective way to do things compared to regular steel or aluminum tray. If the production volume is high enough, at the back there's also an independent suspension setup with air struts. But this time the lower control arms are made out of regular steel. Additionally, there is a ball joint in the wheel hub area, confirming that the Cybertruck has rear wheel steering capabilities as shown in previous late videos. Sandy Moonwork goes on to say that this particular setup is a perfect application of a steel suspension arm as it's relatively lightweight as well as very cheap and very and easy to manipulate. As for the air suspension, the strut has the Tesla logo on it and a metal shield to protect the airbag underneath, but as Monroe says, it looks very similar to all other air struts using in vehicles made by other brands such as the Rivian R1T. The two presenters may say this particular vehicle is definitely a prototype seeing how it has some components that aren't off the shelf parts like some machine bits in the front suspension that look like they have been made using a lathe. Plus, it looks like there's a vault missing along the high vault cable channel and the walls themselves are protected with a rugged cover of some sort. All in all, the two says that, that everything looks pretty conventional and there is nothing groundbreaking in the suspension setup. However, at one point in the video, clues about Tesla's Giga Custom techniques are visible, which is something no other car maker uses at the moment. As always, we would like to see what you guys think about this video. Please let us know in the comment section and make sure to have a nice day.